We have also the possibility to have our XSJS calling a store procedure. That means you can call HANA store procedures directly from the control flow layer. Let's see a quick example. To perform that, I will first create one store procedure on HANA. So I am here changing on my catalog view from the web-based development workbench. I will open a SQL console and run this code right here. So I can basically create a procedure called get BP by type. So I have it created. If I take a look at the SPO demo US, I can look for procedures. And on the letter G, it should be there, get BP by type. So it's right here. So we can test this procedure to see if it's working. So there's an option right here, invoke procedure. And all it asks for is one parameter, like the card type. So I press C. Let's run it. And here we have the content of the response. OK, so that means now I can call it from NXS.js. And to do that, we're going to switch back to the editor, create a new XSJS file. So, so once again, get VP list. Let's call it procedure. And the code again is very similar. Get it from here. OK, so once again, I got this uh, function show data to perform the HTTP get connection again. But right now, I don't need to execute any statement. What I'm doing now is calling the method load procedure and passing the honey schema and the procedure name. With that done, my the object that I'm evaluating, the get BP by type procedure, is now a proxy to the procedure itself, which means you can pass all the parameters that you need as it was the procedure itself. So in this case, we are just passing the BP type as a parameter. The, the output, the, the procedure execution result, going to be hosted in another variable. And we can show that variable as a, in a JSON format to the outside. So this XSJS requires one parameter, that is the BP type. So let's execute it and see the results. So I'll just run this. Once again, the error, because I don't have a parameter, so I'll just set the parameter right here, BP type equal s and here we have the content this time as a result from the procedure itself so here the name of the response that we got from the procedure right here so that's it another way of interacting with hana database using xsjs